The 2021 season of the FIA European Rally Championship fired into action on the dusty gravel roads of northern Poland. And for the centenary edition, and with the summer sunshine beating down on Mikołajki, the ERC Circus set up camp in familiar territory for 14 rapid and abrasive stages. Defending ERC champion Alexei Lukanuk prepared himself for a classic event, but after a big crash at a pre-event test, it was touch and go whether the team could repair or replace his Citroen in time for the qualifying stage. But after a lot of work, their dividends paid off and Alexei set the fastest time on the qualifying stage. But it was the other Russian and a favourite to win, Nikolai Gryazin, who despite not qualifying in the qualifying stage, due to his polo ingesting a mouthful of Polish dust, gifted him a starting position of 37th on the road for the leg one start list. With the road swept clean by the front runners, Gryazin was able to become the surprise leader on day number one. However, a double puncher shattered his chances of raising the silverware on stage number seven. And with only one spare wheel that was damaged already and a double puncture on his car, it was rally over. Day two and Alexei Lukanuk, who was lying second throughout day one, was upgraded to a first class position for leg two. But despite former winner of Rally Poland Andreas Mikkelsen pushing the Russian rocket hard on all six of the time tests, Lukanuk came out on top to secure his first win in his championship defence. Mikkelsen was second, and Miko Marcek was the highest placed pole on the podium. In ERC Juniors, John Armstrong brought the brand new four-wheel drive Rally 3 Fiesta to its first ERC win. While in ERC 2, the victory was taken by Xavier Pardo in the Suzuki Swift, and in ERC 3, was won by Sami Paji from Finland. Next up, we continue our assault on the senses. The European gravel rallies continue north in Latvia as we head to the high-speed action of Rally Leopaya in two weeks' time.